This is a cinnamon gas marble. If you sprinkle some cinnamon onto water and then bend a blunt needle into a J shape and then attach the needle to a syringe and then draw in some air, put the tip of the needle just under the cinnamon and expel the air, then the air will get trapped under the cinnamon layer. And if you then delicately roll that air bubble around and then transfer it to a glass slide and let it dry, you'll get a hollow sphere made of pure cinnamon. And I talked to the person who invented these, and he said that if you make a gas marble using caramel instead of water, it makes a very satisfying crunch. So I tried it. And, uh, <laughs> not only did mine not crunch, they were also just soggy. And it turns out that I actually didn't really make them out of caramel at all. I made them out of syrup. So that's, that's on me. That's my bad. Now, when you make them out of, let's say, syrup or caramel, obviously that's the glue that holds the cinnamon particles together. But if you make them with water, what's holding the cinnamon particles together? I mean, the water just evaporates, so what's left? But here, too, I kind of failed. Mine were so fragile that right after I filmed this beauty macro shot, I knocked over the glass slide and destroyed them all. This is not supposed to happen. If you use the right kind of cinnamon and you do it properly, they can actually survive a much higher fall, as you can see here. So maybe a few water molecules are staying behind and linking adjacent cinnamon particles by hydrogen bonding. That is one possibility. The folks who invented these looked at them using a scanning electron microscope both before and after drying. And even though it's not exactly the same part of the marble, look, you can see the difference here. The idea is that as the water evaporates, that draws all of these irregular, jagged cinnamon particles closer together and they interlock with each other, essentially holding on to each other by friction. Which makes this even more impressive. And sad that I couldn't get mine as strong as this. I'll try again.